Good morning, everybody. It is August 28th, Tuesday, 11.46 p.m. Sorry. <laughs> All right, so these are stainless steel plates. And uh, today's, ex this morning's experiment, you can see I've actually cut out a whole bunch of channels and ridges for the water to flow through. And then there's holes cut out here so that the water can flow up. And uh, we should have good water flow. There we can see, I can move it around, things don't touch each other, it's pretty well solid in there, pretty ground in there. And so uh, we're going to go ahead and hook these up. Alright, here it is all hooked up. We can see, I need to push these wires apart a bit. There we go. So, the wood is trying to make this buoyant a little bit, but thankfully it's absorbed some water and it's starting to stay still. Now, you can see we hooked it up here. We got the white on the positive, the black on the negative. Let's uh, flip the switch. All right, so that's about one and a half amps, almost two amps. All right, we got nothing out of the plates yet. We're gonna let them uh, polarize. And, uh, already have some hydrogen being produced. Yeah, let's let these things polarize and see how it... Okay, so it's 1 p.m. We can see it's operating at just under 2 amps. It is indeed operating, okay. Now, this is what we got for production. This is stainless steel. And it doesn't seem to be doing very much. Which explains why I didn't get my fuel economy on the way back down from Uramus the other day. <laughs> 